My name is Diane Goldstein. I'm a retired lieutenant from Redondo Beach Police Department in Southern California. I'm married. I have a son. I got into law enforcement for a lot of different reasons. One of it is because family was very important to me. I had a brother starting at the age of 11, had a drug addiction problem, and although he was older than me, I was always my brother's keeper. That played a, a large part of wanting to not only help my family specifically, but my community in general. But what I saw is from 1983 to 2004, the ramp up in the war on drugs, the overcriminalization of America, period, has changed the relationship that cops have with their communities. We no longer have relationships with them. We come in, we police them, and we leave. My older brother, Billy, he got pulled over by an agency in Orange County, and he had a pocket knife on him that they said was illegal. He calls me up from jail, and he says, I'm in jail, got arrested, cops went into the hotel room, they found heroin, and that started this couple month quick decline and ultimately led to his death uh, at age 44. Why are we putting people who have a medical issue away in jail? It, it really started making me look at what is wrong with our system? Not everybody is a horrible bad guy. We need to change how we treat all offenders. It's not a one size fits all. Eliminate mandatory minimums. Divert kids out of the system at the first opportunity. Fund more prevention programs for juvenile offenders. I want to try to make certain that what happened to our family doesn't happen to other people's families. We have to give everybody more than one chance in life.